Hi guys, my name is Jean-Swain Saint Charles, and in today's tutorial we're gonna use the Atalus plugin. How to create a couple of things. We'll create some items, we'll create a new skill, we'll create a recipe so we can craft those items. Uh, we'll need to add the skill to the character, uh, we'll add drops to the resource nodes in the world, and we'll create a crafting station. So let's start with the first thing. Uh, if you go into your Atavis plugin, we'll go into items and we'll need to create two items. First one I want to create, I'll create an iron ore. That's going to be my drop from one node. It's going to be a material. I'm just going to select an icon. Uh, those icons I got them from Neojack. If you have the developer edition, you'll get access to those icons, or you can always get some in the Unity Asset Store. And I'm just going to hit save here. Next one I want to create, I'll create a new one, and it's going to be my iron bar. Once again, it's a material, and I'll just add iron bar to the list. Uh, one good thing to do also is change your stack limit so you can have more than one. And I'll do the same with the iron ore. Okay, next what we want to do is create a skill. So I'll go down to combat and skill. And we're going to create a new skill called Metallurgy. So I'll put the max level of 100 and I'll just find an icon that looks like hammer. Right, that looks good. Okay, so primary stat, let's say it takes um, strength and endurance to be able to use metallurgy. That will, this are the stats that's going to uh, grow when you use that skill. So hit save. Now what we're going to do, and I'll go into crafting recipe, and we'll call that iron bar, so that's the recipe we want to make. It creates iron bar, the skill we just created, metallurgy, the station, station required, uh, we're going to use, use a smelter, and here we have, we need iron ore. So one iron ore is going to make me one iron bar, and I'll hit save. Then go to your character, player character setup. So remember that you need to add those skills back to your character, so I'm going to use metallurgy here, and hit save. As you can see, my character is starting with a common pickaxe and a common hatchet. Now we can close this window and we'll go into the resource folder and we'll add the drops, the iron chunk drops. So I'm just going to duplicate one of those, Control D as always, and I'm going to call it iron core drops. So to make it easier, we'll say 100% chance, but we could put like 50% so it doesn't always drop. And what I want to do is go into my item, find my iron ore, and drag it on that element here. Next thing we want to do is create a crafting station. So what I'm going to use, I'll use a prefab I have. This is a NASA that you can buy in the Unity Store. I'll put the link below in the YouTube video. So I'm going to use this forge here. I'm going to rename it Smeltery Crafting Station. Now if you go down one level on the forge, what I want to add is a component and it's a crafting station component. So this one here is a station type like we said smelter, that's the one we want to use. And go back down into your resource folder, 
under I've made a folder called crafting station that's where I'm gonna put all my crafting station drag and drop it here I had that one prior so I'll just delete it so that's my smeltery crafting station I'm just gonna delete this one and put that back in okay now go to your notes and this is my rock node down here I'm gonna say already has a size of 2 and what I wanna do is in the element 2 here I wanna put the resource drop of my iron ore drops like so now you can put those nodes back in the world so I'll just put like a couple next to me like this and save everything then go back into the Atavis plugin down to the resource node and hit save nodes nodes are being saved and as always you'll need to restart your server so I'll see you back in a couple of minutes just logged back into my world I uh, created a new character as we added a new skill to that character I uh, went in to collect some uh, Resource drops so I can craft stuff and went to the crafting station and I'll put one ore in my crafting station and the first time I did it uh, there's a cut in the video as when I hit craft it didn't craft the material so I made a small mistake and I'm gonna show you how you can correct it so if you go back into your database and you go under your skills I'm uh, sorry if you go under your recipe here and we have our iron bar uh, remember I said put in metallurgy here uh, this skill was needed was one and I've put it back to zero because if you log into your world take the character I've just created if you check out her skill uh, you can see that her, um, her her skill are all set at zero right now and that's the reason why she couldn't like craft anything that was part of that skill set so I hope it helps and I'll see you back in your tutorial soon thank you once again my name is Jean-Sebastien Charles Bye-bye.